Welcome back. Today I'm going to teach you how to do a yarn over and crochet. So what I'll try to do here is show you and make this as brief as possible. Um, the reason why I'm doing it this way, because I want you to understand when I say yarn over, there's going to be a terminology YO, which is yarn over. That's the abbreviation for it. So get a notice right here. I'm going to be doing a single crochet. Now it doesn't matter what you do as far as single, double, half, whatever. The terminology yarn over means you'll be placing the yarn over the hook. So you notice this part here, I have the yarn going over. If you did it yarn under, it would be this way. So I'm going to give you a demonstration of both yarn over and yarn under. However, um, the correct way or most of the times it will be uh, probably 90% of the times will be yarn over unless the, um, the pattern system differently. So what I'm gonna do right now is actually I'm gonna just do a single crochet. So I put my hook through here and now what I'm doing is put my yarn over. So you notice it's going over on top and then I'm gonna twist my, my hook, pull through and now I have my single crochet. Again, this is not teaching the single crochet. I'm just teaching the difference between yarn over and yarn under. So I'm gonna do another yarn over. So I'm gonna go ahead and put it through and the yarn is over on top again. So you notice the yarn is on the top of it, not underneath it. So that's the key. And what I'm gonna do is turn my hook to grab this piece here and pull it through. And now that's my second yarn over. Now I'm gonna show you the mistake people make. And well, again, it depends on the pattern if it tells you yarn over, yarn under. But this is what sometimes you'll see people do as a mistake is they'll put the hook through and they'll have the yarn. So you notice my hook is already facing down and you see where the yarn is, it's on the bottom. So it's under, the yarn is under the hook. So some people will just pull it through just like this and that will cause a difference in the way the stitch looks. It'll make the stitch go a little cross, like a little angle. It's not a good way, unless that's what you, the pattern calls for. Um, so just don't do it that way. So again, I'm gonna demonstrate that one again as a mistake. So let's say here, we're gonna do the crochet, a single crochet. If you put it through, and you put your yarn over I uh, yarn um, and it has the yarn underneath that's the wrong way you want to have it the yarn over yarn over pull through and there you go so I know that, that this was actually a little quick one um, but I just want to give you a demonstration because a lot of times people don't know these answers and I just wanted to give it to you so you understand the difference between yarn over and yarn under and you'll see it listed as YH you sometimes you'll see it YH I am YOH for yarn over hook um, so those are the terminologies you need to know, the abbreviations you need to know. And there you go. These are the basics, and I'm glad that you were able to watch this. If you enjoyed this video, please consider subscribing as I got more tutorials just like this for you. Plus, I got a lot of cool freebies below. If you're a newbie, um, if you're just new to crochet, check out the links below. I'm sure there's something there that can help you out with your crocheting hobby. All right, until then, ciao for now.